Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showing my um, bunker tour. And I hand dug this by myself with the help of a couple friends. But um, all the stuff that I used for it um, is all scraps so I didn't pay anything for it. Um, so like that tin. Uh, the roof and the, the other room right there but um got the stairs so that's going down to the main room so um let's go ahead and uh, check it out so yeah it's pretty cool these stairs it did take a few days to build these but it is pretty cool, better than a ladder, I'd say, but, um, oh. so yeah, this is the first room, it's actually fully enclosed, um, and, uh, the floor is made out of, uh, some old deck boards from a deck that we used to have, and I just used them down here, but, a couple of, of sheets of these plywood are newer, because, I got him from a friend, he just gave him to me, and um, yeah, he's like some old, older ones right here, so, um, yeah, but that's what it looks like going up the stairs, so, pretty cool, then this is going into the other room, so there's two rooms in here right now, um, so let's take a look. All right, so now we're on to the second room. And, uh, well, first up, we got this right here. It's like an emergency exit. Um, uh -oh. Um, so yeah, there's so that. Then you can see the tunnel to the other, um, room right there but uh yeah this one this tunnel right here or this room is just dirt right now because um i'm not completely finished with this i'm gonna add on more during spring but um yeah first up right here we have a, a little like fireplace back there it goes back quite a ways as you can see but yeah, it goes back quite a ways. And it just it keeps it pretty warm down here. Just thought that'd be a cool feature to add. And then um, right here we got our little guard. Just a little piece of wire fencing. And I put it over the fireplace like that. <sighs> Let's see. Next up we have our wood right here. Got some wood logs and all that. Sorry, it's a little dark in here. I'm gonna open it up some more. So, uh, yeah. Got some light in here, but yeah, just got some wood and everything for the fire. Some uh, sticks or pine sticks. Um, these are all the tools we used. So, this big rod, um, use a flat shovel to flatten out all the sides. Just a normal spade shovel. Um, we used some five gallon buckets to haul the dirt out of here. And then, uh, just a pickaxe. Right there. And then a small little shovel, which works really good down in these tight spaces. Um, I did build just a little temporary shelf right there. In the, um, walls. So yeah, I just put some empty Coke bottles and uh, some water bottles that are actually frozen right now. But um, yeah, it is pretty cold down here right now. And see, the ground is still frozen, so that's why I'm waiting to work on it some more during spring. Maybe add a few more rooms, who knows, but... 
Um, yeah, that's what the emergency exit. It's right there. I just opened it a little bit to get some light in here. And then, uh, yeah, now let's go outside. And I will show you the chimney to the fire. And then the, the roofs. So, um, yeah. So, um, one more thing. Just showing that, uh, like I said, not everything in here is level and everything. It's for fun. We weren't trying to make everything square and fit. So there was a few gaps in here, but yeah, I mean, what else can you do with spare wood? So, um, oh yeah, so I think that is it. Um, oh yeah, I was going to show the chimney. So that's what it looks like, the chimney. Just a few deck boards, a little opening. And then that little uh, piece of rebar right there. We put it there to um, dry our gloves off in the winter. Cause they would be getting wet so that would it dries our gloves pretty good but um yeah there's uh the little um roof over the tunnel here it holds up pretty good and once again just some uh deck boards which they're pretty thick so um yeah that's that um if you guys like the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And, um, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.